Hi everyone! Welcome to another episode of Two Set Violin. It's been a while since we made a video since the crazy music battle of the century. Finally having such an epic conclusion to the story that started three years ago with Violin Chan. I think it's the um, definitely the biggest audience we played to in one live sitting, right? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Crazy to see a sea of fans, mostly the violin gang. Let's go! How many of you are here for the violin? And there's just so much energy, so we just want to say thank you to all the two setters out there. Those of you guys who were there at the beginning, 2017, 2018, 2019 tour, you kind of know what we do in our concerts. But this time, it was like kind of that on steroids. We added so much more production stuff, and it was really cool. So we have like animation, voiceovers, crazy lighting, crazy effects, and all of that came together at the last minute, so yeah. It was also Davey's first time doing a proper concert too. Yeah. So that was a big deal. And on that, it was like our first time doing a collaboration with someone else. It was super cool. Um, I really enjoyed it. Musically too, it was super fun. Playing with Davey gave us an interesting challenge of how to arrange music to fit both classical and bass music, right? Having all that variety in one concert. And also actually playing with the session musicians too, because this oh. time we had string quartet, grand piano, keyboard and a drummer live playing with us. It was really fun. Yeah, oh, on, on top of that, it was our first time having a click track. Oh my god. Classical musicians playing with a it click track. It is sacrilege. <laughs> I'll yeah. tell you why we need a click track though, because I mean, first of all, the venue is so big to be able to hear the other musicians, but also because we had you know, that massive screen behind us. Yes. And the things that were showing up on the screen were timed to the music which I think was a really cool effect, but it meant that we had to play perfectly on time. Otherwise, the music wouldn't match up with the screen, right? Yes. Yeah, it was very different. I've never done something like this. We had three mic packs on us. Yes. That really scared me. Basically, they had this thing around your stomach, and one is the mic for your violin, one is for you to talk into, and one is the click track. Yeah. And that was confusing. There's a dedicated audio engineer just for managing the click track. Yeah. So at any moment, you can kind of whisper in like bass louder yeah and then the bass will get higher or you can just point to the side stage and be like oh wait the audio's not working oh it is yeah, you can just point side stage also can you have some auto tune please <laughs> just kidding just kidding also oh we're doing like all these late nighters and eddie got really sick like <laughs> about a week and a half before the concert i got really sick i got fever it wasn't covered but still it felt horrible yeah i remember like the day before the concert i'd recovered except I felt like my lungs were still... Like I still had a bit of a cough. There's a scene in the beginning of the show, for those that have seen it, where I have to run. Like, we're running in the audience, yeah. right? The day before, that little run, I felt like I was going to pass out. Yeah. He was supposed to act puffed out, and I was like, that looked really convincing. But then I realized I he was acting. actually puffed out. I was yeah. like... <gasps> now, on the concert, thankfully, it was alright. It was definitely <laughs> one of the most difficult projects that we've put together and honestly speaking Davey has been so good to work with. Davey thank you so much for being so flexible. Without you being flexible I don't think that would happen. Yeah. Also I want to thank you our whole team that made it through. Yes. Everyone works so so hard. Yeah. Thank you for making this vision come true too. I'm really glad we did it. It was yeah. the coolest thing we've ever done. Shout out to all the Singaporean fans and to all the two setters around the world and Ling Ling wannabes. There's a video on demand now. Yes. And the link below, so in case you want to watch it, it will, I think it will run for until the 3rd of March, 11.59pm Singapore mm. time. Yeah. Should we tell them why we did the video on the mall? Oh, oh, okay, why? yeah, why not? Just share it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so basically, initially we wanted to live stream the concert. But with all the moving parts, we've been told that an actual live stream would be risky. And so, after heeding some advice from people, we decided to do what most pop concerts do for live stream which is actually they record a live performance and then stream it yes. at a set time later but then comes the day of the live stream was meant to be seamless there were issues with the live stream that happened and it was really unfortunate because we were watching it as it launched and we we're seeing you know people on twitter I mean, for the hours being like oh there's been some issues we thought okay well that's not good and so we've worked with the streaming platform and they've thankfully been very nice to decide that they will help host that stream as video on demand up till 3rd of March, 11.59pm Which is, coincidentally, 
Brett's birthday. Let's go, 2031. Let's go. Give me more violas, please. I need them for my collection. We also realized a lot of people just couldn't watch the stream at that time. So then we decided, why not launch this video on demand for people that can watch it at their own time? Yeah, so it actually kind of turned out good because some people that couldn't make the stream time now are able to watch it anyway. Yes. So definitely check it out if you missed out on the live stream and you want to check it out because it's really cool. Yeah, and if you guys get a ticket, thank you so much for supporting us. Also, limited time merchandise. Look how epic is that. Go check it out, twosetversdaily.com. And again, thank you so much for supporting. But don't worry for all those two setters around the world. We might be seeing you guys soon. Can't say too much. But remember, as always, go practice.